Hey guys, what's up? Today we're doing a DIY. If you don't know, for those of you who don't know what DIY oh God, means, it means do it yourself. And today, I took out all these bearings. One, two, three. Spins fine. And we're going to be making some DIY bearings. Damn, I can't believe your dad said that. I'm videoing. So, um... What we're doing is we're gonna take these, we're gonna ball this up. Um, this is a um, moon clay. Oh, and I'm doing a giveaway for these erasers right here. These ones. This there's four yellow, four pink, and and four green. I want you to comment. Up. There's gonna be twelve lucky winners. For for those of you, for those of you who want to to win one of these, subscribe. Hit the like button, hit the notification button, Com comment down below what color you want of these, and that's all you gotta do to be in this to win. So, yeah. Let's go. First thing you're gonna do, you're gonna need the clay and the fidget. You're gonna break a piece off the clay. You're gonna need, like, scissors or a butter knife, doesn't matter. And you're going to be shaping the clay when it's on here. So, go like this and you push it in. Just push a big chunk in. And it's just rip what you can out. You're gonna actually going to re recollect it. Like, as soon as you do it. So, there. Okay. So, you're going to take this. Scissors or butter knife. And you're just going to shape it right off. I'll be back in a second because you guys know what to do. Oh, I wasn't. I didn't have that, did I? Well, you just push this on there, just push that in there, like this, you just, with the clay on, you just push it, and then you shape it, with, with the butter knife, like that, so, yeah, I'll be back in a second after I shape it, okay guys, I got the first shaping done, and here's how it's been, this one, pretty good, pretty good, now we're gonna now we're gonna do that same exact thing with the second one like this. Since you guys didn't see it on screen last time, I'll just re-show it. Take a little piece like this, smush it up into a ball, roll it up like a Mexican. Okay, ah! got this back. Roll it like a freaking pizza. Okay, <laughs> now we got this all rolled up. Let's get the little saplings. How long is this video so far? Oh, it's only two minutes. So this first DIY is going to be pretty cool, actually. I didn't know it was going to be this cool. No. Push. Push it in there like that. Just rip it off. Perfect. I'm going to reshape it again. Be back in a minute. Okay. So this is how it spins with two. My hands are getting all messy. All messy. See that little part right there? I'm just gonna like dab that off. Maybe I should zoom it in a little bit more because it's gonna be kind of hard for you guys to see. It's harder. I'm I'm get I'm guessing that's harder actually. So like one point seven one point times seven is fine. This is the last one I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna show you guys of me making it so it's easy so you guys know what to do. For the last part, because this last part, you want to roll it up to a ball, like you legit want to roll up into a ball. Because I have a cool design for you guys. If you want to do this. Nah, I don't have a cool design, I'm just blabbing with you. Okay, so last time, last part. And just so you know, this will work with Play-Doh, clay, um, almost anything you want to use it with, so... It's a, like a win-win. Push that in there. <sighs> really? Like, come on! <laughs> My pinch has been... <laughs> this sucks! Ah! Ah! Oh, sorry. Well, I'm just gonna do a few things with this. 
I was just joking around with the buy part. Can't, I'm having trouble picking it up. Let's resume out. Remember about that giveaway on them. Remember, like, subscribe, hit the notification button. Um, and leave, comment down below what color you want. Okay, that's the end of the video. Bye!